Good morning, everybody, and welcome to another episode. Me and Rebecca, we are out on this beautiful uh, Lake Cowichan. We're doing some fishing, and I don't think I've showed, shown you this yet, but if you look down here, I got a new uh, rod holder, I got a new fishing rod, so I'm kind of setting this up for, uh, for a fishing boat. Anyways, today's video is uh, gonna be a cooking video. We are gonna be making sushi. For the longest time, I've wanted to make sushi, and uh, I haven't uh, uh, ever done it. So that's what today's episode's gonna be. Roll that fancy cooking intro that I haven't seen or that you haven't seen for a very long time. While the intro was playing, I actually caught a fish. I'm not joking. Oh, I think we might have something on here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we do. We do. Look, guys. Woo! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Wait, this has been like two hours. Oh, my goodness. All right, all right. We did let the fish go. Um, it swam away, happy camper. Take a look behind me. Look at this smoke, guys. Look at this smoke from BC wildfires. There's, all, there's over 600 wildfires um, in British Columbia right now, and there's a lot on the island. It's sad, it's very sad, it's still here. Anyways, we're gonna head back in and uh, cook this sushi. On our way back, we just uh, saw a caterpillar in the water, and we just saved it. Look it. <laughs> He's so happy. <laughs> Need to dry them off. They're all fluffy. Cute. This is where we are right now. So we're back at the camper and we are gonna make for the first time ever sushi with my girlfriend and we're gonna make this together. All right guys, we're in the camper. Uh, slide is out, which is really nice. I haven't had my slide out for a very long time. Just to show you how much how much space we actually have in here. Um, some things I did off camera really quick. See this rice right here? So this rice is short grain white rice. And what it wants you to do is it wants you to basically wash it four times. And so you put the rice in, put water in, wash it and then siphon it all, all the water out to get the starches out and then do that three or four times then it says fill it all back up and let the rice sit in the water for 30 minutes the rice has been sitting for 30 minutes and we're ready for the next step so for ingredients we have one cucumber pickled ginger wasabi avocado natural white rice vinegar seaweed sheets also we were gonna do salmon, but decided to go with crab. So we have some imitation crab. That's all the ingredients. Oh, and some, uh, like I said before, short grain white rice. If you'd like to follow along at home, um, we just got this at the a grocery store. Short grain white rice, but it says sushi on it. So you obviously can't go wrong with that. So that's all the ingredients. Uh, but now we're just going to drain the uh, water from the rice right now completely. That is the next step. So the amount of rice that was there and the amount of rice that we're following for the ingredients is three quarter cups is the amount of rice. And then it says if you're using three of those, 540 milliliters for water. So that's 540 milliliters. I'm going to pour that in and we're basically going to cook the rice now. Okay, so in your small saucepan. Small saucepan, yep. Yeah, you have a third a cup of rice vinegar. Third cup rice vinegar. Or, rice vinegar. Or 80 milliliters. Or 80 mils. 80 mils. Okay, three tablespoons of granulated sugar. Tablespoon. One, two, three. One and a half teaspoon of kosher salt. Put into a small saucepan and bring it to a boil over medium-high heat. 
Bring to a boil, sugar, salt, dissolved into the water. Smells awful. <laughs> smells like very strong vinegar. So now we're gonna take this bowl, bigger bowl, flatter bowl, put a little bit of water. How much do you think? Well, so it doesn't stick, right? Yeah. That's probably good, I think. And then we're gonna take that, put it all in here. All of it? Yep. Okay. Okay, sushi vinegar is being poured over the rice. Slice the rice at a 45 degree angle to separate the rice grains instead of mixing. So don't just like stir oh, okay. it. Separate. At the same time, you need to use a fan <laughs> to cool the rice so the rice will shine and doesn't get mushy. Trying to cool it down. We got the AC direction, <laughs> direction with the fan. And we're cooling her down. So the rice is somewhat cool right now. And uh, it says just get a damp cloth, cover the rice up until we're ready to, uh, to use it. Look, look at the zoom, <laughs> zoom action, ready? Look at what we got going here. We got a little crab, trying to cut it into like thinner, uh, longer lines here. This is really good. So we're ready to uh, actually roll the sushi roll. About not putting the rice all the way to the end. Right. Because then at the end you can wet this and close it. Okay, gotcha. So basically to the edges, but not to the end. Leave an inch on each side. Uh, I don't know if you need to on this end because you're gonna, you know. Right, right. Okay. But just the one end. Right. Go for it. I'm just gonna. Yeah, so am I. Let's do it. What should I do? <laughs> That's gonna be a huge sushi roll. Not bad. It's so still pretty big, but that's that's impressive. What? Good. Yeah. So I'm kind of just rolling this like I would like a wrap, like I'm pulling all the the, the crab and the cucumber and the avocado to the edge, and then I'm just kind of rolling it over, and it's working. And then I'm gonna take your trick. Just. Wetten this a little bit, and then roll it right on over. Voila! Around midnight, way up high, there's an angel in the sky. The glitter and the shine, she must be divine. What a night. Just to give you guys an example, this was our first roll. So a lot of rice. And then this was Rebecca went and made a second roll, which looks way more like sushi. Looks exactly like you buy it from a store. Take my hand, you promise. And Just like in a restaurant. Delicious. I've sent my wishes far to get you in every way. Anyways, that's it for me today, guys. Hope you enjoyed the sushi making. You did a killer job, by the way. Well, you killed it making that sushi. And uh, until next time, my friends, take care. Keep living that dream. Subscribe if you really, really feel like it and you want to see more videos. Have a good night and bye bye. Back up. Yeah.